Hello, this is Jonathan Landeros with Kativ Technologies. In today's video, I'm going to talk about a little known tool called Redefine. What this tool does is it literally lets you redefine the face that defines a sketch or a work plane. Now, a picture's worth a thousand words, so a video is probably worth a lot more. So let's jump in and take a look at what the tool does. Here I have a box, one that might contain electronics, for example. And if we look at the box in the bottom, we can see it gives it a certain directionality. Now we also have this shape on the side. Maybe I've machined that so we can mount something to the side of the box. And let's say for the sake of discussion that it's on the wrong face. Now I could very easily just resketch it on another face. And that might be a completely valid option depending on how much work you have into it. But if you've put a lot of work into it and you don't want to redraw something, you can go ahead and just redefine the face that that shape is on. I can do that by finding it in the browser, taking the sketch, right clicking and choosing redefine. Then I go and choose the face that I want to place this shape on. And we can see that it goes in but it's not in the right orientation. I can fix that by editing the sketch. And I'll go ahead and I'm going to remove a couple of the references that I no longer need. And once that's done, I can go ahead and use things like my standard sketch rotation tool to turn it around and put it in the correct rotation. Once I get that done, I can go ahead, drag it, drop it, use any sketching tools that I want to reposition this. And then I can just redimension it and put it in the new position. It can be as simple as that. Now, is this a be-all and end-all and this is going to be the tool you go to every single time? Frankly, no. There might be places where it is easier just to go ahead and redraw the geometry. But do consider it another tool in your arsenal where instead of going ahead and just redrawing that geometry, you can redefine it and save yourself a little bit of work. Like I said, it's another tool in the toolbox. Thanks for taking time to watch and we'll see you in the next post.